a point of an example why I don't like Sonic Adventure DX is because of these games being added here Sonic the Hedgehog 2 which was also in the DX copy here uh, can unlock it Sonic Spinball was actually in Mega Collection Mega Drive Collection so I don't really want to play the Game Gear version and I don't like it at all no matter Sonic Triple Trouble oh my goodness they really brought back the messes in Game Gear games I don't like Sonic Drift the racing I do like uh, Sonic Sega and Sonic All Stars racing yes and Tails is uh, Tails Sky Patrol Hmm, Tales Adventure. Vector Man. Why do they put Vector Man on this game collection? The Sonic. Oh well. Should be Sonic games, not Vector Man. As you go through the option, you actually Sonic the Fighters illustration. What's that? Oh, we get another look. Sonic Fighters. Why do I won't care about these games? Yeah. So let me see, like, showing off. Tails, maybe. Knucklehead. Yeah, I love Knucklehead. He's really funny. These are cool. Are you sure you've seen off these images on the internet somewhere? Here's like the my rules for the Sonic game. You go into the Sonic R. There's a PC version and a Sega Saturn version. Yeah, yeah, I go for the Sega Saturn one because it's pretty interesting. This is the American one because it's got a key and A on it, key and A on it, something. Yes, R, A, B, or something. As you go into it, you're dodging into this black and white manual. See? So, yeah, this is a black and white manual. I don't know why this is black and white because most manuals saw Sonic back in the 90s were actually in colour. I think it's due to the fact that they couldn't waste any more money and uh, they was getting broke. Is the... Whoa, is that the Sega Saturn? That's the Sega Saturn, guys. That's what the Saturn would have looked like. The Saturn controller? Man. They probably done the best they could. Sonic Jam was actually one of my favourite games. Oh my goodness. You saw this in Sonic R. I mean, obviously, it's pretty good to look at manuals. And, um, yeah, I've seen the museum. Games, extras. What's the look? Hints. Sonic R. Move the character R on the tail screen and you can move the character R on the control pad. Also, press Y button to change colours of the R. Oh, I didn't know that. Skip. To turn Super Sonic Super, in, if you place the Radiant Emerald secret level as Super Sonic, it will play a different song than the one it normally play <laughs> obviously I knew that you just press down and stuff little hint when playing Sonic R I don't know if you can see the control here see that analog stick press down on that to get Super Sonic on the option screen oh, that's it for my gems collection I hope you liked the game it's, it's one of my favorites and the re main reason why I think we is being a rip off now but I don't think it is that much just the fact that um, they're not selling the GameCube backwards compatibility which is kind of annoying I, I just think Sonic Fighters oh my goodness just by looking at it you can tell I don't want to play this game I mean look at it it's too challenging, even for my standards. Yeah, I wasn't really keen on this game. Sonic the Fighters. It's really annoying, doesn't make any sense. The gameplay is 8 demos instead of 7. 
Sonic CD, I really didn't like much about the gameplay. I was alright with it, I just didn't like the way it was done. I mean, the fact is, you actually hit the enemies and turn them flowers back. You know, you turn in the flowers back to the way it should be, instead of bannocks. The special stages, I could not believe how horrible the special stages were. Sonic R, excellent game, the best out of the whole bunch of this. I really think they could have put more games on you, like uh, Chaotic Shooty 2X, um, what was the other ones? Uh, Sonic, uh, well, all the classic Sonic games. I mean, they could have literally called it the uh, Sonic R. Sonic. Sonic R could have been one of them because I mean, the fact is they show Ginky games, uh, Ginky games, on it. Funny, Sega used to have a like, Sega console that was a handheld. It's called Game Gear. Then Nintendo has a like, Nintendo system that is called a GameCube. What a coincidence! I think Sega may have been connected with Nintendo when they did the GameCube. Well, that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video, and yeah, I think Sega and Nintendo are rivals or enemies, now revivals, and good revivals of that, because I think Mario would make Sonic look good. I mean, they got a new... Oh, I'll try to exit this. Is there an option where I can reset and eject, is it? And it shouldn't have uploaded then. Did realize I just reset the game. There's plenty of Wii games for the Wii system as well. But I don't use this system for Wii games because I got another Wii. That actually does that for me. Hope I didn't slap my day. It's still only I don't. Because I love them. I love the GameCube. What do I mean that it looks like a cookie? And why is it called the shit cube? Wait, you can't exactly insult Nintendo. It's not the shit cube, buddy. It's called the Nintendo GameCube. The best of the best cube of uh, the cube system ever made. Probably the only system to make it. Be thankful that they did. Oh, and the part with the cookie, I couldn't believe how much of a laugh that was. I just couldn't believe how stupid this guy was. I mean, calling Nintendo GameCube shit is like saying the Wii is bad. Oh, wait, they did say that on one of the reviews. I think, to be honest, to be fair, I really, really wish I kept this Wii. Um, well, this is the system that started it all and in my opinion the option of GameCube is there now this is a problem with the blue Wii it has this option but you can't play GameCube games why? I mean I know it's Mario and Sonic at the end of games I'm not trying to bitch or bash around with it at least you can still play Wii games but why aren't you allowed to play GameCube games on it? Why? Why have you got to tilt them in Wii? The awkward way around. I mean, if you didn't bother giving the stand up, I suppose that's a message. But it was much better with the stand. I mean, the Wii stands up properly because the desk clean. Well, I suppose you can't complain. I mean, it's only a Wii system, so. Sayonara, Mochius Grass is all good things to say goodbye.